Well, it looks like it's garage cleaning day. George is moving some of the uh, stuff from the garage over to the new barn. Let's see. I can follow him over there, which I cannot. There he is. I just put the tiller in there. I want to take it out there. Okay. It's too heavy for both of them. I'll say. All right, let's go to the barn. Well, he's walking the tiller out because it was too heavy for me to lift, basically. Is that the front coming in? Oh my gosh, folks, you are witnessing the front. The, the front. Woohoo! You saw it here live. yet but it's windy look at this stuff just look at it that's from Tex he chews up everything if he can't find your sprinkler he goes and drags up a piece of wood and chews it into splinters Sarge what do you think about that Sarge what do you think about the coal front Tex why do you tear up all that stuff? Tex, why do you tear that stuff up? Tex, why are you tearing everything up? No, it's not you. Yes, it, yes it is. Well, wonder how all the animals like the norther. Oh, I bet they like it. Rusty, you like it? I'll take it because right now, oh, it feels so good. <laughs> Round two, I'm gonna go pick up some more junk. Gooby, do you like that dog food? Gooby, you gonna eat all that dog food? Hmm? I think we're going to. Uh, cook some asparagus and potatoes. Asparagus, of course, wrapped in bacon, as always. Jerry likes that. And one of my favorite cuts of meat is actually one of the cheapest cuts of meat. And it is called a chuck eye steak. You need to go look for those. But you got to make sure they're at least three quarters of an inch thick or so if you're going to barbecue them. They're excellent. I like them better than ribeye. I like them better than any of those others. And thank you, Julie, for the rub. I used it on the nail guy and the pork the last time when we smoked it with Jason was here. And I used it on some other things. And... I'm using it on this today, so thank you very much. We're going to go out and throw it on the pit. jacket on <laughs> how do you like it oh I love it it's nice I'm out here uh, threw some stuff on the barbecue pit and enjoying this nice cool air oh, man. It just feels so good. Uh, um, 
normally on a day like this I would have made a pot of coffee and made some cookies but it kind of came after lunch and uh, or was it before lunch but it was early later than I expected or whatever anyway <laughs> yeah, that would be Starting to cook. Oh, yum. Mmm, mmm. Flame broiled steak, bacon wrapped asparagus, and baked potatoes. I can't wait. Sarge ran off. He didn't want any part of doggy training. Oh, he came back. Oh, settle down, settle down. Big old boy. How much do you think he weighs? <laughs> About a hundred pounds, I think. He's pretty stout. He uh, could be uh, 11 months old Sunday. Not even a year yet. <laughs> Flame broil steaks. Ooh, baby. Ooh, you light my fire. Ow! Yummy. Yummy. It's a little bit rare. All right, I don't want a rare. Clean mm. ball a little bit. Alrighty. Let those steaks rest a little while. Honey, mm -hmm. it looks awesome. Yeah. We hope so. Well, we just got in and uh, fixed our plates. You can see it's uh, <laughs> pretty hefty plates. So, I guess. Okay. Dear Heavenly Father, we thank you for this food which we are about to receive, and we thank you for the wonderful day we have and the cold front that blew in. We pray that you'll bless this food for the nourishment of our bodies. In Jesus' name we pray, amen. All right, honey, I'm tasting the steak first. Go for it. Now, I notice you don't have any sauce. What's up with that? I'm going to try it with Julie's seasonings on there. We're going to see what it tastes like. But, Julie, don't be offended if he does take sauce. He is a sauce man on his meat, and I like meat with this meat. That is tasty. It's pretty good. I don't need any sauce. Not too smoky or anything, just wonderful. Let's try this loaded baked potato. So, I didn't put butter on mine, but I have enough sour cream to make up for that. Yeah. With some cheese and some hollering pinas, as George says. Jalapenos. Yeah. See how that is. I put butter on mine, but I like real butter made from uh, Falfurious butter. I'll show you, matter of fact. 
Cal Furious is a community close by. They make their own butter. I'm ready to try these asparagus. That's it there. That is some good stuff. Okay, I'm tasting the asparagus, bacon wrap asparagus. And for those that need it in English, that's what it says. Mm -hmm. I don't think I've ever had bacon wrapped asparagus grilled. It's delicious. That is delicious. Boys are texting. Texting. Mm. Don't all of you have family group texts? Chats? Well, honey, I'm ready to eat and get off camera. What about you? I want to eat whether they're going to watch me or not. Well, would you like to say anything to maybe somebody that's watching for the first time? Well, welcome to the channel. We haven't named it yet. It's still under Melanie Crocker, but we're fixing to uh, come up with something. So, subscribe. Push that notification bell or... or what are, what are, it is a bell. Okay. And uh, that give us a thumbs up. That notification bell will tell you whenever we put out a video or if we go live or something like that. So, folks, I'm ready to eat. I hope you have a good weekend. And uh, may the good Lord bless you. Amen.